We have reached a dead hand in dead hand bail on the Essex Sussex border, where John Constable found first inspirations for landscape painting. But we want to carry on to Lavenham in Suffolk. It seems that Lavenham is just being cleaned up early in the morning, especially for our visit. After final sweeping up operations, we carry on our morning sightseeing tour of Lavenham with camera. You can turn and twist it as you like. The swan at Lavenham, at the bottom of High Street, always presents an attractive view from whichever angle you look at it. On Lavenham's marketplace, the modern traveller also finds fine accommodation at the Angel and at the Great House. Let us have a short look together at the marketplace in the morning sun. There are also some shops at the marketplace and some holiday cottages. We, for our part, stayed at Staddles, a self-catering cottage on top of Church Road, and a cozy romantic nook with all modern conveniences. You will have to book early with Helen and Burgess if you want to stay a whole week or longer here. The village butcher supplied us with succulent sirloin and lovely minted lamb chops. And Mem Sahib brought fine Indian cuisine on our free kitchen days. Our evening ale we generally took at the cook in near the top car park with some local inhabitants. Passing up High Street we come to the Greyhound Inn. Queen Elizabeth the first never slept here but allegedly Napoleon III did. We did our window shopping early in the morning, before the shops opened. That was not so good for the shopkeepers, but better for our holiday purse. We too were tickled pink by this tea room sign. And further up at the post office, we wondered who still throws letters in the letterbox in these days of emails and mobiles. Anybody for dinner in the evening or perhaps a cycle tour? We for ourselves prepare to have a last look of lovely Lavenham in the golden evening sun. Lavenham gained market charter 
in 1257 in the reign of King Henry III, allowing the citizens to hold a market every Tuesday and a fair in Whitson Week. Up to the present day, the market hosts a farmer's and a French market at regular intervals and some community events. We finish our view of Lovenham to discover some beauty spots nearby. <music>